Hello, this is Tulshi Sen from Thailand. Actually, I'm, I'm recording this for you in a th for the third webinar. Instead of the webinar, I'll be giving you a talk from a temple called Wat Palad. It's a Buddhist temple in the mountains of Chiang Mai in Thailand. You've seen that um, uh, talk on the temple on YouTube before, but I've come back here to talk to you. You can hear the cock crow and you can hear, you can hear the birds chirp. And you see, today's topic is why can't we hold a vision bigger than ourselves? And the reason that I am here in this very spot is to give you a graphic explanation of what it is all about. Here you see two statues and that's actually the gateway to the temple. That is the gateway to the temple right here. You have to walk up the steps and go to the temple. These two statues guide you through how to hold a vision bigger than yourself. So I'm going to give you an example. You see, first of all, you need to want something. That pointing finger is intention. You want to want something. You can't go into the temple without a desire. And when you desire something, you have to desire so much that these three tri th this trident is past, present and future. You annihilate time and space. You see it as already yours. And then, this is the very attitude you go with. And this, are the, this, this statue tells you why you can hold this attitude. You see, right now, that hand is holding a conch shell. And that hand holds a book. And that hand holds the nectar of immortality. And this hand annihilates time and space. This time and space over here is turned backwards. And this thing is a symbol of unity. You're everywhere and everyone at the same time. Now I know, I know that's too much to take in at one grasp. But to walk through that temple, to, to, the, to, the, to the Holy of Holies, to that place where your consciousness is, you have to have this attitude. And this attitude will determine how big a vision can you hold. Your vision cannot be bigger than yourself if you do not lift yourself to that level of your vision. Like I told you in a seminar once, can you hold a vision of being a billionaire? And most of you giggle and chuckle as it, come on, get out of here. Can you hold a vision of being a millionaire? Uh, maybe some people do have the aspiration because they have heard so much of being a millionaire. But really, how many people really believe in it? Can you hold a vision of being a hundred thousand year? It's a 50-50 chance. But if I told you, can you vision having $10,000 in your account or $20,000 in your account? Yes, I can. See, that is the attitude. These are the two statues that determine that. 